here we have a little juvenile eastern rat snake. This used to be called the black rat snake, and when they're young, they have this pattern to them, and um, then they change color into usual black that people used to. It's the largest snake we have uh, here in, uh, in Virginia and in the Mid-Atlantic. Um, this, it can get just short of eight, of, of nine feet, really. Um, this is a baby. It's got the typical rat snake little eyebrow thing going between its eyes, and uh, again, it's gonna pretend to be big and bad. It's an attempt to try to, uh, you know, scare me. It, it's not dangerous, but it'll shake its tail, which will leave sonic rattle, and it'll strike. And this used to be a great defense. If you were uh, an, a predator and it looked like it was a rattlesnake, and if it looks like it was striking, then you would, um, you know, you think about leaving it alone. It could be dangerous. But now, of course, that backfires. If somebody sees a snake hissing, rattling its tail for sure, which a lot of snakes do just to pretend to be something else, then they get scared and they think it's going to be something dangerous. But again, this is not a dangerous snake. And I'm going to put my hand near it and I'll see if you can get it to strike. Again, it can't hurt me. It's not a big deal. Can't even bread draw blood. But maybe you can get an idea. There you go. You get an idea of how you can get this. Go near, near the lens. Come on, buddy. One more try. Now leave you alone. And there it goes. Little Eastern rat snake. 